Well, 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 it seems like all we're gonna do today is talk about KSI, so, so be it. Now, KSI's got his second platinum for this year. Yes, I have to do it. Platinum! Platinum! I'll give you some, some... <laughs> on Don't Play With Amory that he released back in January nine months ago. Now, in his nice little tweet responding to the Brit Awards, he tagged Ricegum. Now, if you don't quite know the history of that, I'll explain. Ricegum, who a lot of people really don't like, he said roughly two years ago that KSI would never get a platinum award on any of his songs ever. Second of all, I will make sure to tweet you when I get a platinum plaque. I will make sure to tweet you again when I get another platinum plaque. But a little while ago, KSI got his first platinum on Lighter, and in that first tweet, he tagged Ricegum. And a certain song has gone platinum, ladies and gentlemen. So let's just say 2021 is looking very good. And you know what? <laughs> as soon as I get the thing that shows that I got it platinum, best believe a certain person is gonna receive a tweet. <laughs> Now, Rice Gub came out with this really weird response, saying that basically this is so old and everything. Look, Rice Gum's a bit strange. Big shock, obviously. But yes, he got his second platinum award. He tweeted again at Rice Gum. Uh, actually, shit. I think I've got my platinum plan. I haven't opened this yet. Well, I mean, I did, but it's because my address is here and I don't want you to see where I live in it. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Jesus fucking Christ! Bro! <laughs> Can't wait to get another one and tweet at you again, bro. <laughs> so yes, now we've officially won the battle as KSI supporters. We have more platinum awards than Rice Cup does. But seriously, this is a colossal achievement to add to KSI's now arsenal of achievements when it comes to his music career. Not only breaking into 10 million monthly listeners, only the second YouTuber to ever do so. If you're asking who is the first, well, Joji. You might know him as Filthy Frank. He has about 19 million monthly listeners and really has transitioned into a proper music career. However, that doesn't take away from KSI's achievement at all. Then a couple of months ago, following his release of his very popular album, All Over the Place. Wait, hold on a second. Ugh. Following the release of his very popular album, All Over the Place, he received number one album on the official charts. And yes, I, I did buy the merch. But that totally shook up the internet because we had a YouTuber winning number one award across all of the albums that week. He posted this to Twitter, thanking everybody for it. Yo, your boy did it. <laughs> Finally got it. Got number one. Number one album. Mad. <laughs> Thank you for everyone who supported. Uh, shout out to all the fans and all the supporters. Legit, I wouldn't be here without you. I wouldn't have this without you. And it's crazy. I've been doing music for so long. Massive achievement. Then, as you know, the KSI x Lil Wayne song came out, which not only was the first time KSI reached top 10 in the US Billboard charts, but also for a little while was Lil Wayne's number one song on his Spotify in terms of popularity. Now, the popularity tab on Spotify is a little bit weird, but out of the hundreds of songs that Lil Wayne has made over the years, KSI, you know, the YouTuber who in 2014 was rapping parodies over his beat. Check that shit, I'm hello rich. Time is money, so check that hour. Major salary in that hour. Back and will I am, cause I'm the one with power. Magazuki needs to go get drop kit by a constipated bear. Now held the top spot alongside Wayne on his popular chart. Incredible achievement. And there was resounding support for that song. Everybody loved it. Also, it was weird for the hardcore Lil Wayne fans to hear Lil Wayne singing. Bearing in mind, Lil Wayne is a notorious rapper. But the bottom line is here, the achievements that KSI is making in the music world continue to amaze people. He is fantastically talented when it comes to music, and combining with his business acumen, is basically creating this symbiotic rocket of a career that is only really maturing as we speak, and now will be propelled into the future with added force. And we're getting more and more signs that KSI's music is here to stay. He will continue to improve and improve and invest more money in getting better. And I honestly don't think this is the last time we're gonna see a KSI number one album or a KSI Platinum, which today was confirmed. He got his second Platinum. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Congratulations, KSI, on your second Platinum. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Congratulations, KSI, on your second Platinum. Subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.